it's five minutes of or four minutes of and I'm standing out front I'm the first person in line again waiting for Goodwill to open so I might not do my shopping cart uh, scene I might go right to the aisles and uh, get right to business people are getting behind me now so wish me luck all right it's very hard to get in here without um, oh look at that baby doll she's interesting um, I did get a card of stuff already as soon as I came in. There's a guy that comes here every week, too. We both race to the same section, but it's all good. I got some stuff. He got some stuff, so that was cool. She's kind of neat. Uh, no Jesus, no peace. Okay, so I just figured, well, that's kind of cute. Is that a glass star on it? Ooh, that's kind of neat. I got a bunch of stuff. Um, that's a cool Santa back there. It's a nice basket. Um, there's some spoon rests here. Let me load, let me put this in my cart here. Sorry for the crookedness. Um, I did get some stuff. I did get some stuff. I'll show you in a little bit. I'm just um, taking another pass through here because I was first in line again. And man, everybody just runs past. That's a nice mirror too, right there. But I don't like dealing too much in mirrors. They kind of scare me. I don't really see anything else here as some of these piggy that they made, little figurines. A lot of stuff I saw was nice, but it was broken. So let me see what's here. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. That's a topper to something, a lid to something. Um, so yeah, I'll show you on this side here. There's some cute things. There's this music box, it's 209, but one of the flowers is broken. Um, here's a candle holder, but it's flashed, so uh, you don't get them when they're like that in that condition. That's a pretty box right there. It looks like Vera pattern. It is a Vera. It is a Vera Bradley box, so we'll pick that up too. And let's see what's under here. Oh, those are pretty designed too. What are these? Furio, made in Indonesia. It's got a nice print on it. All right, there's more people coming down the aisle. I'm gonna have to stop for a minute. All right, this is really pretty. I wish it had the lid to it. It's only $1.39, but that's probably why it's only $1.39. That's just glitter. Uh, made in China, but it's really heavy. It's very, very pretty. Uh, gravy boat's really nice. This is pretty, but the flashing's coming off of it. Otherwise, I would have got that. That's really nice. Very pretty piece right there. But once it starts peeling, that's it. Okay. And over here, we have this cute little votive. That's 209. Made in China, but it's really cute. Let's see, 209 on the top. And yeah, all right. That's a cute piece. This is nice here. I like this one too, but it's flashed. Uh, crackle glass, votive holder. This is a cool uh, stainless steel tankard uh, mug, 309. That's really neat looking. Um, so we're going to keep looking. We're going to keep looking. All right, we're here in the metal aisle. Ooh, I think this is a cookbook stand. How much are you? 509, but you're really pretty. We're going to think about you and put you at the bottom of the... We're going to put you at the bottom of the cart here. Hopefully it won't fall through. We'll think about that because it's senior day and I get 20% off. So that's a possibility. Um, these are neat. I like those. There's a bread box here. And let's see. Pretty flower arrangements on the end cap. Uh, pet bowl feeder thing. That's a good price. 309 for that. Just have to find the bowls that uh, fit in it. Nice metal leaves. Now, if that had the bowls in it, I would grab it because those good, go for good money. And that's a really pretty one. It's a really pretty one. Who knows? Maybe we'll find the bowls in a couple weeks, but uh, I'm not going to take a chance on it. I don't think so. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see what happens as the day goes. But I do have a bunch of stuff in here. Here is a bunch of copper stuff. This is 209 um miscellaneous copper stuff here's a chopper it's 409 I'm not really interested in that that's a pretty cool candlestick holder 
Um, okay. I really don't think... Why is there a purse here? You never know why stuff is here. Okay. Um, well, that was pretty, too. A butterfly uh, ring holder, but there's no price on it. Oh, look at this. Trinket box. 89 cents? Yeah. How did I miss that? It's not even metal. And it's in the metal aisle. That's how you find things, too. All right, I think what I'm gonna do is check out the glasses and mugs here, and I can get back to you. Um, but a lot of them look the same. We used to get a lot of good mugs here, some individual mugs that were really cool. Ooh, that is interesting. Look at the lines on that. That's pretty cool. Uh, the Army mug is still here. The Coca Pelli mug is still here. But first, coffee. That's a copy of a Ray Dunn. And pretty sunflower ones. I'm not seeing anything that jumps out at me. So if I do find something, I will let you guys know. So I will be back. I'll be back. And uh, oh, look at this with the birds on it. Oh, that's nice. How much are you? 109. Look, it's got a whole bunch of birds on it. That's cool. I might get that one. We'll get that one for now cart is full though already so we're gonna put that there and hopefully it'll sit there all right I'll be back all right they're feeling like crazy here uh oh this looks like somebody's flag when they passed away the way they fold it 309 for the flag uh not really. Oh, look at this suitcase thing with the elephant on it. So I just showed you guys a picture of something. And it's something that I didn't get. It's one of the other resellers that comes here every week that I talk to. He granted it's like a religious thing. And it's a music box. And it's very cool. Margaritaville coasters. But there's only four coasters. It looks like it would hold six. So I'm not going to worry about that. Good old mishmash. We got hair. We got hair, of course. So I want to see what else might be here. There were some Hallmark ornament boxes, but they were all empty. So that didn't help me out very much. Oh, cross-stitch kits. That little camera thing baggie is still here. Well, how much did they have for this? 209 No. No, no, no. It was 109 Oh, look at these glasses, man. Laid up glasses. Woohoo! Look at that. Bootsy Collins. Oh, there's a big Chuck E. Cheese. You see him? You see him there? Robotic hand kit. Puzzle kits. More hair. Silky hair. Okay. A little jewelry box with, um, or sewing box. I can't open it. It's just a box box. It's a box box. We get notebooks, journals, UB glue stick. I don't know. It's a dollar nine. That might be a good thing. I don't know how much UB UB glue goes for. That old faux candle is still here. Uh, love story. Oh, Spider Man. Uh, Spider Man umbrella. Okay. I don't really think I have the clientele for that, so. <laughs> uh, First Communion Bible with a cross. 309. I don't know what condition it's in, and they sealed it up. Body Ecology Kids Sculpting Soap. That sounds like fun. That sounds like fun. 69 cents. That's kind of cool. I don't, I don't need it, though. Uh, let's see what else we have here. Oh, check him out. He's a biggin. Oh, more hair. Fancy that. I gotta really condense this cart down too because it's it I'm full. Because of the way I have it stacked in here too is the problem. Because I was just grabbing as I went. Warped candles, yay. And I'll keep going. Um that guy buys a lot of stuff that type of stuff that I do, so I'm glad I got what I did when I did. I really don't see anything else here in this. What is this? 
That's a cute little notebook. Icicles are still here. Oh, here's a big foofy ball. Balls, balls, balls. Big foofy ball. Composition book. Uh, Hoover. Vacuum filter. Sometimes they're worth good money. I just don't want to deal with those. Um, not seeing. That's crazy because usually the old people come here and they're digging through this stuff looking for the bargains. But it doesn't look like there's many bargains to be had here. This is a little meltdown canvas board. Oh, when you do that with the crayons. Very cool. I don't know what makes that different than other canvas board. This is pretty empty here. It's pretty empty here. A sleeping kitty with a chipped ear. Nothing spectacular. Oh, the baby elephant they threw in here too. Ooh, poor little guy. He is so sad. Should we... Oh no, he'd be 20% off of a dollar nine. He'd be like 90, 89 cents. Oh, he's broken. They threw him in here and he broke. That's sad. Corksicle. Okay, that's not there. And more hair. Got more hair. And beer hacks. That's from Ollie's. Diapers. Plates that somebody threw here. Okay, I think we're done in the mishmash. I really think we are. What is that? Don't know. Don't know, don't care. Okay, we are going to move on. All right, we're going to try out the plush. First thing I see is a sea turtle with two baby sea turtles on its back for $1.11. So that is a possibility. We put that in the cart. Let's see what else. We have a pink koala. Uh, some. Oh, we have a dinosaur. We have another Minecraft here. That's the third one I've seen here. Cute little dinosaur. A uh, little bunny. A uh, wabbit. There's this guy on this side. He's really cool. He looks like one of those boardwalk toys you would get. Uh, let's look over here. That's a neat dinosaur. Oh, he's broken. He looks like he's from Jurassic Park. He's broken. That's a shame. That's a crying shame. Oh, look at this little turtle. Hello, turtle. This is so cute. We got a troll. Um, some cooking, kids cooking stuff. Fake food and whatnot. There's the big old Chuck E. Cheese. Let's see how much they want for him. Um, looking for a price. Here it is. $3.09 for him. Not really... Uh, into the Chuck E. Cheese. Is that Dora? Oh, here's a cute little bear with just ice skates on with no clothes. This must be cold. And let's see. We have a couple stampers that thrown in the, with the plush. We have a big Snoopy. We have a Yoda, but he's in bad shape. He's a big Yoda. He's a big giant Yoda, but his ear got chewed by a dog. He's 309, unfortunately. If his ear wasn't chewed, I'd try to clean him up. And this little guy's still here. Oh, the Minecraft cow is still here. Hello. And let's see what else is here. A little owl. Uh, a bunny gnome. Whoever she is, I don't know who she is. Maybe you guys know who she is. And, uh, oh, the Scarecrow from Wizard of Oz. Dollar eleven. He looks got an older tag on him, but it would be nice if I could get the set, not just to sell him by himself. But I don't see the rest here. Um, I think we're done. Let's see what you are. Oh, you're, you're an octopus, all right. Okay, I think mm, it's a dog in a dress. I don't see anything down here either with the games. Nothing interesting. Baby Taz ball looking thing is still here. Here is a, oh, that's cool. That is uh, Santa on a snowmobile. That's adorable. Sings Jingle Bell Rock. Maybe, maybe it did it one time, but that's so cute. I miss snowmobiling, so I can't wait to move up north to go snowmobiling again. There's uh, the pink Blue's Clues. I don't know who that is. And 
Oh, that's an old baby doll. That is an old baby doll right there. That's a creepy baby doll. And this baby doll is 409. And I don't I can't read anything on the back of the neck, but that's an old baby doll. Uh not worth me getting it's not my thing. So let's look over here and see what they have. And Ryan's World Rocket Ship and some other miscellaneous stuff. Alright, let's move on. Alright. Uh, these are very, very cool. And I just wanted to show them to you. Here's one. Very, very neat. And here's the other one. How cool is that? I think they're both 709 each. And I would get the discount off of it but they're too big to deal with and I don't have the wall space in my booth so I'm not worried about that so they're neat though um, I didn't really see much here he was in the aisle one uh, just ahead of me so that's when he got that religious thing and that was in this aisle so that's cool that's cool everybody gets some stuff here no big deal right share and share like can't get everything at once so I'm not seeing, this is a cool piece of recycled glass. It's very heavy and I don't know what you do with it, but it's really neat looking. I don't know. Okay, I think we're gonna move on from the wood aisle because there's nothing really much here to show you that's cool other than those uh, sculptures, which I'm sure somebody will pick up today with the discount. That's great if somebody has a uh, room in their home and they wanna get it for their home, that's an outstanding price for them. They're huge. Okay. I also checked out over here and I really didn't see anything. Like I said, all these ornaments, there's some really cool ornaments, but the boxes are all empty. I don't know. I guess they took them out of the package and brought them up to the register to get them cheaper, but they weren't that expensive anyway. They were only a dollar nine. This is kind of this poor pitiful, this poor pitiful candle that somebody put in here. This itty bitty little candle. It's cute, but it's very lightweight. It would probably tip over with the candle burning. I think the candle weighs more than the holder itself. So, again, I didn't find anything here worth talking about. So, the stuff that's worth talking about is in my cart. Look at that little bitty purse. That's adorable. All right. They put some stuff over in that first aisle, and I probably missed out on stuff, but that's okay. All right, there'll be more coming out. I'm going to stay here a little bit longer. Not much to talk about in the plastics. Not really my thing. So, all right, we're going to keep moving. All right, we're in the art. We're in the art. It looks like uh, nothing. Uh, wash your hands, you filthy animal. This is us. As a matter of fact, I, need, I do need another pair of shoes. Um, some lady just was here, and she took all the old frame stuff the little uh, like religious stuff the very old stuff so that stuff's not here that unicorn stuff this is cool the little diorama that's adorable but not for me this is cute too the raccoon print and it talks about the artist on the back that's kind of neat so I'm um, just looking here and I don't really see anything else um, this is pretty, the ducks, but it's way, way too big. And it's got something on the bottom, but that's okay. We'll leave that for somebody else. Okay, that's it for the art. Well, I'm in the bowls and plates and stuff. Uh, somebody did get those metal sculptures already. They're really nice. If you have the room, all more power to you, but I don't, so. 
Um, just looking here, seeing if there's anything interesting. And there's not much here. But I see a lot of stuff that I like that people have in their carts. So that's cool that people are grabbing the, the neat stuff. Nothing really. Nothing great here, guys. She's been here a while. She's got a broken arm. Um, just not seeing... I'm just not seeing anything. Paisley's still here. Ooh, what are these? Let's see. Ooh, those are cool, too. These are nice, reticulated. But they're black and white. Nobody really wants that kind of stuff. Oh, there's a cool terrine with berries on it. Looks like a hobbyist piece. These are cute. These little Argyle 309 for the set of four. Cookie jar without a lid. And this is still here. I just don't know what it what it would be for. So I leave it here and it's still here. Maybe other people don't know what it's for either. And then on this side we have the cookware stuff. Pot lids and cooking utensils. Here's an oldie right here. That's an oldie. Dollar nine silver plate. But um I can't tell. Oh, that's all uh flowers on there. I don't want to stop talking too long. Here is, oh, these are $5.24 each. Oh my goodness. We're not going to get that. Don't see anything that catches my eye here. So we're going to get out of this aisle as well. That's very cute. And um, see if we can find anything else before I go. Those are kind of cool with the ducks and the butterflies on them. Aren't they pretty? Those are nice. I want a bunny rabbit on them chickens those are really cool all right those are still here the set of four pots they look like flower pots okay All right, I'm in the purses. I really don't see much. When I see a good name, it's either too expensive or it's beat to you know what. So, um, not really seeing much here for the purses. But I did a Rosetti. I don't know. I don't know the names. Uh, some of them are nice quality, but they're filthy inside. I don't know what that symbol's for. I never love my schnauzer. We've got more over here. I did grab an eel skin bag. It would be 20% off of $4.99. I want to see how much they're going for. I know the wallets go for good money. Um, but we'll see how much the purse is. It is a little dirty inside, but I think I can uh, clean it up. So we'll see. Liz Claiborne. That's pretty. I don't know what that one is, but that's got a nice pattern on it too. Embossed pattern on it. That one is $4.99 as well. I don't see a name on it. Kenneth Cole Reaction is still here. I don't know what that one is. Not sure. Uh, not my thing. Not really interested. I'm not a girly girl. I don't like. I don't care about the purses. That's a Vera, but um, it is disgustingly filthy inside. I'm not even going to show it to you. So, um, this was cool, but it was fifteen dollars, like a shoulder bag. Oh, somebody put something in here. A little polka dot bag. Um. Not really seeing anything here. So I'm going to check out the eel skin one. And Oh, here's this. This is cute because I'm in the south. I'm in Georgia. So it's the, uh, I forget the name of the, you know what I'm talking about. It's not on my brain right now. Uh, Gone with the wind. All right, so I'm going to look this up and I'll be back. So this is cool, Magnolia Time Sugar and Creamer set. That's kind of cute, but it looks 80s or early 90s to me. This, I'm like, what is this thing? I couldn't figure out what it is. It is actually a wine bottle holder. Is that not cool and modern? That's very cool. So the bottle rests here and then the neck comes out here. And if it was 209, I would have got it, but it's 409. But I just want to show that that is a really cool bottle, uh, wine bottle holder. This is a pretty plate made in Italy. Um, it's made by Wacamaw. Wacamaw, not for food use. It's made to hang up. Uh, it would be 20% off of 209. Again, not my thing. 
This is beautiful. People, this is from dishwasher washing. Look how gray and hazy that is. Otherwise, this would have been an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous piece. Um, 309 for that. But I don't know if I could get the cloudiness. I know you, you could put some elbow grease in and do it, but um, I'm not really sure if it's worth the time. So that's very sad. Very sad. I just wanted to show you. All right, I just wanted to show these to you. Uh, these are $2.09 a piece for the grinders, but this one does not work, and I can't really make out the name on the bottom of that one. Um, then we have these, and these are $1.09 a piece, which is very, very strange, and I'm thinking of getting those. I might get those, um, and stay positive, everybody. Well, they're still bringing stuff out, but I think I'm going to call it. I have stuff to do. I have to get ready for my sale. Those are kind of neat. I'm going to put flowers in those, uh, pictures in those. Look at the size of these monsters. Those are for some big candles. Um, there's a cloche. I was thinking about getting that, but I'm not going to. I think what I might do, that's a pretty little pie plate. That's a pretty vase, but it's broken right in the front there. I think I'm going to do a recap for you guys. They're still bringing stuff out. I'm just tired. This is cute too. One of these little decor pieces. One of these plastic ones. I forget what this stuff is called. Um, I can't see that. Made in USA. I just don't remember the name of the company that makes these. And it's the only, only the one piece. So we're just going to leave that here. 209. Here's a footprints wall hanging thing with the penny here with the cross that's kind of neat um nah i'll save that for some else too i got plenty of stuff i'm happy with what i got okay i think we're gonna do recap next all right guys we're gonna do recap i'm getting these two crates which are great for the booth and great for home and great for records um, they're 409 each, so they'd be 20% off of that. I'm getting them. I'm getting these, this package of 3D wooden puzzles. I think they're all dinosaurs for my craft sale. I got this cute little cottage core or basket of eggs, not necessarily for Easter. So that's really cute. I like that. Uh, possibly a Vera bag. Uh, this bag, or I don't know what it's for, I guess makeup, it's got clear plastic in it, but it's got kitty cats all over it. Um, I am getting a couple of these Bodycology Kids soap kits for craft day. I think I grabbed five of them. They're hypoallergenic and paraben uh, free. This is for personal use. Um, I'm going to get this butterfly, freestanding butterfly metal sculpture. Uh, I have little radish salt and pepper shakers. I'm picking up. Picking up this beautiful pitcher here. A uh, little Starbucks ornament. Spuds McKenzie. Uh, I guess it's a spoon rest. It's from World Market. Um, this mug here. Get it, girl. Ray Dunn. Get it, girl. So that's kind of. I like finding the interesting ones. This is very interesting. I don't know what it's supposed to be. Some kind of weirdo face. So I'm getting it because it's weird. Um, this bottle here with the blue glass. Oh, is it broken? Uh, it's broken. I'll put it back. I didn't realize that. Okay, that's got to go back. I didn't realize that was broken. Um, I got this cool person, lady thingy. It's for your bathroom for magazines and toilet paper. But I'm going to use her in my booth for jewelry. She's going to have necklaces hanging from her. And I'll figure out something clever to put there. But isn't she cool? I do have another human figure display. But it's so covered in necklaces right now that you probably don't even notice it. So I love her. Um, the sea turtle with the baby turtles. I'm going to get. I'm thinking of these candle votive things. So let me take them out because I'm not sure yet. Those are interesting looking. Um, I don't know. I think these for drips on candles. You put them over the candles and then it stops them from dripping. Oh, there's only three. Uh, this is pretty. 
this is a pretty piece here uh, it would be off of 509 so I might be getting that I have to check it for damage um, an old chopper don't we love those old choppers remember them everybody then uh, a trinket box a religious trinket box and a Ray Dunn puppy love bowl that needs to be cleaned uh, those salt and pepper shakers with the grinder uh, some glue sticks for my craft sale these are all individual um, bookmarks and they're all cut paper cutouts the Asian paper cutouts I wanted to get a purse for myself a little change purse inside my pocket because I can't keep my money flat because my wallet's so short and I came across this one how cute and perfect is that a kitty cat one so I'm paying up a little for that one but it's for me so that's okay um, a scooper for that cat rescue friend of mine he needs a scooper more of the soap um, yes there's a lot here this cactus I think it's for a candle with a snuffer on it a Vera tin these cute little apples these would be great for um, for the kitchen don't worry we're getting there this um, ladybug I guess it's oh 709 I think I'm gonna put that back it's not I don't like it that much worth but it's a cute ladybug uh, bird feeder and it's stuck in my cart so we're gonna leave that out and uh, nightmare before Christmas tablecloth possibly and possibly this one but I see I see some damage now I see some damage to one of the flowers it's minimal though it's very pretty so I might still be getting that and then I have stuff underneath too I have that uh, what is that cookbook cast iron cookbook thingy holder and this like egg basket and I'm trying to get the handle back into the proper position it was all squished so I think I'm happy with what I've got um, if you're not already subscribed please do so hit that like button hit that notification bell set it to all please leave a comment please check out my other thrift with me videos they do have their own playlist on my channel and I do sell this stuff on my channel so until next time guys see you on the flip side bye